This video is brought to you by Coolstream. Bluetooth products bring you wireless music, cool and easy. Free shipping in the USA. Hey guys, Joshua Bainsek, and I want to show you how to get the system update going for your Moto 360. I got the notification yesterday and I wanted to show you guys a video of how to do it and the process of what it looks like. So what you're going to do is, you know, you get your notification here and you can either just kind of dismiss it. Uh, but the other way that you could check on the update is to long press the power button. Go all the way down to about. Click on that. Scroll down. You'll see system updates. And you'll see either it'll be saying download complete or ready to install or it's going to say that it's up to date so you're going to get one of the two messages you'll get this or the other so we're going to go ahead and click out of this that's one way and I'm going to do it from the notification so here we go swipe left to install hit open download complete and ready to install kind of gives a countdown timer So it powers down, felt a little vibrate, got a little status bar here at the bottom, got our nice little Google kind of boot animation going on. So it's going to take a couple minutes to get the status bar going. We'll see what happens after that. And one thing that you're going to want to make sure is that your battery is actually charged up. I tried to do this when it was about 69 to 70% battery, and it said I needed to charge it, so I put it on the charger, got it up to about 94%, and it let me go at that point. All right, so got another little vibrate. Looks like it's rebooting. Got another vibrate and everything should come back up as normal. All right, so yeah, we're getting that normal boot animation. Try to do this from start to finish so that we know how long it takes. So I might ramble here for a minute or two, just depending how long it takes. So if you've been able to get a Moto 360, what's your thoughts about it? Have you received an update yet? Let me know in the comments what you think about the watch, how the update went for you. So far, I've really enjoyed it. If you haven't seen my unboxing and also my review, I'll leave a link in the description of where you can find those at. i got more videos on the 360 coming. So you're going to definitely want to subscribe if you want to see more 360 content. Let me know which version you got. Did you get the silver like I have or did you get another color? Have you swapped out the bands for something else yet? I'm actually looking to get a different band myself. Probably going to look into maybe getting a sportsy kind if there's one out there. That way I can wear it for, you know, sport activity. Like this leather isn't really, in my opinion, it's not really made for getting all messed up. So kind of want to see what other options there are out there. And it looks like we're all booted up. Everything should be all good. No notifications coming through so far. I don't have it connected to my phone right now either. So yeah, see it says disconnected, but you can still see some of your other stuff here. So yeah, that's how the update goes. Pretty much all you do is just click on the notification, hit the check mark, and it does everything for you. So if you thought that this video was helpful to you, please give a thumbs up. And if you have not subscribed yet, please do so so you can see more videos like this. Yeah.